Hi everyone, welcome back to Code Dice. In this particular video, we'll discuss uh, two topic. One is called as a dis, uh, default exception handling. Another one is your exception hierarchy in Python. So basically, what is a default exception handling? Right. First, we'll understand this particular topic. Default means default, right? No customization, nothing, right? So default exception handling means uh, if in your program, if exception will occur, right? Then what exactly the Python behavior, right? What exactly the Python behavior? What exactly the default Python behavior, right? So this is what exactly called as default exception handling. Default exception handling means uh, suppose one exception will occur, then what Python will do? Huh? By default, what Python will do? If will not handle it or something like what Python will do? So that is what a default exception handling, right? So observe very carefully. Theoretically as well as programmatically also will discuss so that you people will get more clarity. Fine, right, sir. So observe. Introduction to default exception handling. In Python, all the exception are object and corresponding class is there. Sir, what it means? What exactly the meaning of this particular point? In Python, all the exception. You can take a type error. You can take a waste error. You can take a attribute error, the arithmetic error, zero division error, overflow error. Any error means any anything, anything, all are one one object. All are one one object and corresponding class is there. For those object class is there, na? for each and every object class is there, corresponding class is there. I'll cover that point at the end. Don't worry. Just inject this one in your mind that in Python, all exceptions are object and for all those object corresponding class is there. We'll discuss that one in exception hierarchy in this video all. okay we'll discuss okay fine so observe very very carefully here what is the default exception handling so in python if any exception will rise then python virtual machine will create corresponding exception object what it means suppose if you created one program a is equal to 10 b is equal to 0 a divided by b which exception will come zero division error so, if zero division error will come, then Python will create a, what? Python will create one object for which class of zero division exception error class. So, each and every class, each and every error or exception, each and every exception are one object in a Python, right? So, if any exception will rise, then the corresponding object will created by Python virtual machine. If a file not found, exception will come if you are opening a file but file is not there then immediately python virtual machine will create one huh, create one object for file not found suppose if you want to access a key if you want to access a key but key is not available so you will get a key error exception you will get a key error exception how you will get python virtual machine will create okay if something if some exception will come, then Python virtual machine will create the object for that exception. If exception, exception will come, Python virtual machine will create the object for exception. If Y exception will come, then Python virtual machine will create the object for Y exception. If Z exception will come, Python virtual machine will create the object for a Z exception. If a file not found, file not found exception. Uh, object it will create okay if a key error key error attribute error attribute error zero division error zero division error io error any something like so what is the conclusion point means i know you people are getting some theoretical or boring or something like but wait wait inject this thing in your mind it will be very very helpful in the next class right so in python all the exception are object and for all those object corresponding class is there already built in class is there so what is default exception handling in python if any exception will rise then python will create a corresponding exception object if a file not found the exception will rise then python virtual machine what will do python virtual machine will create the object for something like a file not found a class okay ready right sir what is the next one observe very very carefully very very important point in Python, if any exception will rise, then Python virtual machine will create the corresponding exception. Then it will check the corresponding handling code. Suppose, suppose 
one exception is come zero division error what zero division error exception come then what is the first duty of python virtual machine suppose observe very carefully suppose one exception exception come zero division zero division error zero division error exception come then what python virtual machine will do python virtual machine will create the object for zero division error class then immediately python virtual machine will search uh, handling code handling code try accept handling code if handling code is there no problem if handling code is not present then it will stop the flow of executions that's it ready already we completed this concept in a previous class so default exception handling means uh, see in the default exception handling means uh, if any kind of default any kind of exception will occur then python virtual machine will create the object corresponding object if after creation of corresponding object then it will check the handling code is there or not if handling code is there then it is very okay if handling code is not there then it will stop the normal flow of execution by printing the exception information abnormally it will terminate so example wise observe very carefully so a is equal to 10 b is equal to surendra print a divided by b then print thank you so here no problem no problem but here what we are doing you are dividing a integer with a string which is not possible so that means what will happen here it will raise a exception it will raise a exception which exception it will raise so it will raise a type error exception immediately python virtual machine huh, it will raise a type error exception immediately python virtual machine will create the object for it will create the object for something like a type error okay and it will check a handling code but handling code is not there if handling code is not there then immediately immediately it will going to give you what uh, exception information and it will stop the flow of execution remaining code will not execute hope you guys are getting the clarity about default exception handling default exception handling means if any exception will occur then python virtual machine will create the object for corresponding exception then it will check whether you provided the handling code or not if you provided the handling code beautiful if you didn't provide the handling code then it will print the exception information as a, and it will stop the normal flow of execution abnormally it will terminate and if you provided the exception handling code handling handling code then it will uh, not terminate abnormally okay any doubt again one more thing in default exception handling if exception will occur then python virtual machine will create the corresponding object for corresponding class okay then it will check the handling code is present or not if handling code is present then okay if handling code is not present then it will stop the flow of execution abnormally by printing the exception information any doubt injects these things in your mind sir what is the next one next one is a okay so already any doubt with this one i don't think i don't think any doubt but still i can go for some practical Yeah, suppose I want to open a file, I can write a physicals to open. And I want to open a file, that file name is suppose um, um, no, text or sub, that file name is something like my file. My file. Dot txt. Sir, observe very carefully. Here I'm trying to open a file that is called as Ah, don't worry about this file. I'll cover in file concept. Okay. A lot of video will come. So a physical to open my file.txt. That means I'm trying to opening what a file called as my file.txt inside a, my current working directory or inside my current working folder. But unfortunately, this file is not available. If it, this file is not available, then what will occur? Exception will rise. File not found exception. Then immediately Python virtual machine will create the object for will create the object for what object for file not found exception or file not found error class it will create the object then it will print then it will search the handling code but i didn't provided the handling code that means it will stop abnormally by printing the 
exception information. So fine. Yes, you are getting. Yes, right. But same situation, e file writer, this is suppose your risky code, or you can say critical code. I can write uh, like this, and e file provide file not found error. And here I can write a print file is not found. Okay, or file doesn't exist. File does not exist. Now it's, it's you can expect the smooth termination. Okay, so that means what you can write a print thank you here. So it will print thank you also. Yeah, so here we are handling. So what is the mechanism is what? Here in this exam, in this uh, something like a code, uh, when I'm trying to open a file, but it is rising what? Exception, which exception? File not found, uh, error exception. File not found, error exception. So Python virtual machine will do what? Python virtual machine will create one object for which class? File not found, error class. Then immediately it will search for handling code. Handling code is present or not present? Present, if it is present, then no problem, you will get one. If it will not present, then you will get error. Okay, then you will get a not error. I can say then will uh, abnormally program will stop. So instead of file not found, I'll write a zero division error. What guys, uh, zero division error, zero division error. And here I'll write a, something like I don't write anything. I'll write pass, that's it. So here, uh, here I'm trying to open a file. That means uh, this file is not present, means it will going to give you what? It will going to give you a file not found the error exception. But immediately Python virtual machine will create the object for that uh, error, uh, that exception. And the Python virtual machine will search the corresponding handling code. But corresponding handling code is not there. Handling code is there. But it cannot handle, it can handle zero division error. It cannot handle file not found error. So immediately program execution will stop abnormally file not found error. Any doubt, sir? Sir, no doubt at all. Mm. Yeah. So already cover. Yeah. Next is called as exception hierarchy in Python. Very, very important. Inject in your mind. That's it. So in Python, base class is the parent class of all the exception. Observe very carefully. Inheritance concept. Huh? In Python, in exception handling mechanism, who is the base class? Who is the base class? Main class. Huh? Base class, base exception. Base exception is the topmost class and base exception having multiple child. Direct child, indirect child, multiple child is there. So here, exception, keyboard except interrupt, system exits, something like a generator exit. So these are what? These are the child class of a base exception. These are the child class of a base exception. Right. Again, exception is having multiple child class, arithmetic error, attribute error, name error, OS error, value error, type error, lookup error. Clear or not? In Python, all exception are the child of base exception. Ready? In Python, or in Python, all, all exception, all exception are the child of a base exception. Clear or not? Write this point in your note here. In Python, all exception are the child of a base exception. So exception is also the child of a base exception. Right. So again, exception having multiple child. So okay, this is something like which which one? Hierarchy, hierarchy, right? Okay. So here exception having multiple child, just like a uh, called as arithmetic error, attribute error, name error, OS error, value error, type error, lookup error. When you will get arithmetic error, you know. When you will get attribute error, you know. In the case of when you will get attribute uh, arithmetic error means uh, zero division error. It's something like called as attribute error. Uh, something like, sorry, something like called as arithmetic error. No problem at all. Right? Okay. So if some variable is not there, okay, suppose I created one class, uh, but uh, in that class doesn't contain one attribute and I'm trying to access that attribute. Attribute error. Sometimes you will get name error also. Right, a variable is not declared and you are trying to access name error. 
Sometimes you will get away, sir, or whenever you will open a file. Whenever you will open a file, unfortunately, the file is not present. You will get away, sir. Again, away, sir, are having multiple classes, multiple childs. What is the child means? A file not found. One is what? A file not found. File not found. Then time out. Time out. Time out error. Okay, file not found error. Lot of error. So next one, value error, type error, lookup error. Lookup error is what? Something like we'll get uh, index error. Okay, something like key error, index error, key error. So these are coming under lookup error. Clear? In exception hierarchy means uh, all the classes uh, are by default child of a base exception. Inside exception, we have a lot of classes like arithmetic error, uh, attribute error, then something like name error, zero division error, uh, sorry, name error, OS error, value error, type error, lookup error. That's it. Arithmetic error means uh, we will get some zero division error kind of things. Attribute error, we are trying to access an attribute, but attribute is not present. Name error we will get, uh, OS error we will get in the case of file not found, time error, right, value error, type error, lookup error, index error, key error, lot of errors are by default. All the errors are coming from base exception. Sir, why this concept means we will discuss in future, right? Suppose uh, uh, like a uh, if he wants to uh, um, you, you if he wants to work with the type error so you have to write type error we will we'll cover practically in the case of uh, try except finally okay rise keyword we'll discuss everything practically so that you will get clarity so just two point i cover in this video the first point is uh, what is the default exception handling default exception handling means uh, if exception will occur uh, in, in your program then python virtual machine will create a corresponding object for that exception right so already cover corresponding exception for that uh, object right then it will check a handling code if handling code is there no problem if handling code is not there then what it will do it will uh, stop the flow of execution abnormally program will terminate at the middle that is what exactly uh, default exception handling. in python all exceptions are object for all those objects, corresponding class is there, na? corresponding class. And in Python, all the exception class are by default child, by default parent child of a base exception. Base exception is the father of all the exception classes, whether it is a key, keyboard interrupt exception, system ex, 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 exit exception, generator exit exception, name error, OS error, file error, type error, VLOOKUP error, EOF error. Attribute error, arithmetic error, zero division error, any error, or any exception, all are child of a base exception. Ready? Fine. So that's it. And thank you so much for watching this video. We'll meet in the next video for continuation part. Thank you so much.